words can be. Hello booktube, my name is Katie, welcome to my channel and another video and today I have got my January to be read. Now as always, TBRs are subject to change but I always try to attempt to stick with it as best as I could so please keep that in mind. So first of all I am going to begin by telling you the ebooks I plan on reading. I have got the originals The Rise and this is obviously based on the originals TV show which is a spin-off from Vampire Diaries and they brought out a book with this and I freaking love that TV show so I'm going to want to read it of course I am but that comes out this month so I'm really really excited to get around to reading that. This next ebook that I want to read is called All the Bright Places by Jennifer Niven. I'm not sure how that is pronounced but the picture will be over here which is absolutely gorgeous and I've heard fantastic things about this book already. This comes out near the beginning of January and it's probably going to be one of my next reads if I haven't started already but my god this book sounds so good and I have been told that if you like The Fault in Our Stars then this is definitely the book for you to read. This next book that I plan on reading is a book that has several short stories in that is compiled together by the very lovely Mallory Blackman and this is called Love Hurts and it just sounds so so good and I cannot wait to begin to read this. Oh my god, seriously, definitely I love short story books. The next ebook that I plan on reading is called I Was Here by Gail Foreman and I'm told this is quite a dark contemporary that would definitely get you right here and it's not what you would expect from Gail Foreman because obviously she likes her romance books but oh I've been told it's just so so good so I'm really really honestly so excited to dive into this. It doesn't seem like a very long book so it probably shouldn't take me long to read but that comes out near the end of January I believe so definitely keep your eyes out for that. This next book is called The Prey by Tom Isbell and this cover is freaking gorgeous. I'm so excited to read this book and it's just, oh it sounds like a real interesting nude sort of dystopian oh my god i really love the cover to this book it looks so so good so definitely looking forward to that and this next book also has a really gorgeous cover can we just look at that so twisted fate by nora olsen i cannot wait to read this book it sounds really really good and come on the cover the cover just makes me want to read it and now we move on to the physical books and first of all i have the here and now by anne brushes this comes out in the uk at the very very beginning of january so i need to get this read it's quite a short book actually and i've been told that it could be like real realistic to what could happen in the world and it just sounds really really good so definitely look forward to reading that the next book that i have got is there will be lies by nick lake this comes up on the 6th of january and it's quite a chunky book but boy does it sound really good plus it is yellow so bright and like a bumblebee the next physical book on my list is Can't Look Away by Donna Kuna and I believe this comes out on the 8th of January but this is about a girl and she is a YouTuber and all of a sudden she is being bullied and I've heard really great reviews from other blogger people already about this book and it just sounds like it's going to be fun and a really great read. The next book on my physical list is Better Than Perfect, also known as Wild Cards by Simone Elkeles, who writes the Perfect Chemistry series. But I really, really am in my moods for contemporaries at the moment, and this is one that I keep eyeing up. I did start this a couple of months ago. I read the first chapter and I got really, really into it, but I put it down. I think I put it down because of work, if I'm honest. So I need to get cracking on with this again, and it is told from a dual perspectives. So that is what I like about this. And the final physical copy book is one that I am going to be reading with Keisha, and that is Paper Towns by John Green. I need to read another one of his books, and I believe this is being turned into a movie as well, so I need to get this read as well. And I've had this on my TV list for ages, so it would be great to get this read. And it's not a big book either, so it shouldn't take us long to finish it, so that'd be great. And I think we're planning on perhaps reading that together and then maybe talking about it at the end of the month. So if we all go ahead with that plan, then feel free to join in with that live show. But we will definitely let you know as soon as we have planned it. That is the end of this month's 
TB oh, list. I'm so excited for so many of these books. Oh my god, so many books are coming out at the beginning of the year that oh that sounds so good and that I've had great reviews of and oh my god I think 2015 is going to be a fantastic year for books definitely fantastic year but let me know down in the comments if you have read any of these if you'd be interested in any of these because it'd be great to know let me know if you have got a January TBR and if you've done a video you can link it in the comments below and that way I as well as everybody else who sees the comments can check it out give this video a thumbs up if you have enjoyed it because it lets me know that you enjoy these sort of videos keep smiling keep reading and be happy and I will see all of you guys in my next video bye